Well, Sound Jersey, it is time for the second of our two storms that are coming through between yesterday and today here. Now, this one not as severe with the rain, but more severe when it comes to the coastal flooding. And that's where we'll start off here. We have a coastal flood advisory in effect for Cape May, Atlantic, Burlington, and Ocean Counties from 7 a.m. to 1 p.m. We are anticipating most areas to be in either high minor or low end moderate flood stage across the area flood stage on our thursday night was in minor stage and that was not forecasted so i am anticipating for us to be near that moderate threshold that's when many roads flood not just the usual ones here and not only that we can start to see water into unraised homes and businesses with this strong northerly wind that we will have, winds will be sustained along the coast 25 to 35 miles an hour during the morning. Inland, we're talking about 15 to 20 miles an hour. Otherwise, the rain will continue to fall this morning. It won't be as heavy as it was yesterday, but I do believe we are going to see rain for the morning and then end between noon to 2 p.m. on Friday. Rainfall totals... Should be anywhere between a quarter of an inch to a half inch this morning and into the midday hours. And that should put us at a total, a grand total, between two and a half to three and a half inches. And some of you, yes, we'll get close to four inches of rain. Now, after two o'clock, the winds will gradually die down here. I don't think we see any clearing, though. I think we're pretty cloudy for the rest of the day as temperatures actually fall from the 50s into the 40s here. So our afternoon will be in the 40s, wind chills in the low 40s. High school football, if it happens later today... Well, we'll have kickoff temperatures just around 45 degrees for most places. Eventually, we'll get that clearing sky to come out. And we should be in the 30s by the time we get towards midnight here for everywhere in South Jersey. The shore will stay steady in the upper 30s for our lows on Saturday morning. We'll be at or just below freezing for most of the mainland. And we do have a freeze warning in effect from 2 to 9 a.m. on our Saturday. Halloween itself... Bright, but on the chilly side, temperatures about 10 degrees below average. We'll be in the low 50s for most of the mainland. The shore will be just shy of 55. Your trick-or-treating times, well, during the evening hours, 4, 5, 6, 7 o'clock in the 40s for most of us here. We'll stay in the 40s for our Saturday night. Make sure to turn your clocks back on our Sunday morning here. And then we go into Sunday morning. Temperatures will be in the upper 30s for most of the mainland. And we'll be in the mid-40s at the shore. We actually will warm up as we go into Sunday. Morning sunshine will give way to clouds. We could even see some showers during the afternoon hours on Sunday here, especially along the coast. We'll have the latest for you at 1.30 and 6.30. We'll plan for your weekend. We'll also get you out of this storm here. You can follow me on social media for the latest. Or you can come right back here to depressivac.com slash weather.